What's up guys? Today I'm doing a review on the Duck Camp Vantage Pants. This is the pin oak color and today I'm going to give you guys a truthful review. I need to say before I start that these were not sent to me by Duck Camp. I purchased these with my own money uh, because I am pursuing a upland pant that I really enjoy wearing and I thought this might be a good fit. So today I'm going to tell you the good and the bad that I found with these pants and hopefully it'll give you guys a good review to either help you pull the trigger on buying it or changing your mind and going with a different brand. So starting out, uh, I will say, I didn't put it in the video, but the bag that these came in, um, I'm kind of a, a display snob. Uh, it was really cool. It was a, a really awesome branded bag and it just made the brand feel cool. So I appreciate what Duck Camp did there. Um, their branding is definitely on point. Uh, it came with a really nice tag. Again, these are the Vantage Pants. Now, when I put these on, you'll see what I'm talking about, but I've already tried these ones on. Um, there's a couple features I really like. The first feature I really like is this waistband. It has the Duck Camp logo all the way around it on all four sides. I'm not sure if you guys can see that or not, um, but I think they advertise it on the page as well. It's the, the Duck Camp part is like a rubber. Now, I wasn't sure if I was gonna like that or not, but I really like it. Have you guys ever worn the pant, a pant that's just like either a hair too big or whatever, and it keeps sliding down? The one thing that these pants don't do is slide down, and it's because of this. It's not too sticky. You almost don't even realize it's there, but what you, you do realize is that the pants are secure, um, and it almost makes you feel like you could wear it without a belt. So that is a, a really cool feature I do like about this specific pant. This pant has a couple of really nice pockets. Uh, it's got two zipper pockets on each side. Uh, the pocket size in the front are really nice. Um, it's also got this here, which I believe is advertised for a knife, um, which is really nice too, actually, if you carry a knife on a regular basis. And then the back side, it's got one zipper pocket and one uh, button pocket here, or one, uh, I'm sorry, Velcro or uh, magnet pocket here, um, which is a pretty cool feature. The magnet pocket's really nice. Um, you're seeing that start to happen a lot more, uh, especially with like bags and stuff. So I'm gonna try these on, and when I try these on, I'm gonna tell you my biggest con to these, um, and you guys will hopefully understand. Uh, before I dive in, I am 5'11", pretty much between 175 to 180 pounds is what I vary. Uh, my waist, what I wear with majority of my pants is a 32 waist and a 32 length. And so I will dive into the sizing and why the sizing is my biggest concern for this pant of why I probably won't keep them. All right, so you can see them on. Now, I will say I really, I really like the material of these pants. They're super stretchy. Um, they don't fit bad, so I don't want to have this come off as it's a, a bad review. It's not at all. Like I said in the prior clip, I'm a 32-32, so 32 waist, 32 length. These are 32 regular size. Um, on the website, it said, I think it was, if you're 6'2 or taller, to order the talls. Um, but my biggest complaint is how short these are. So these, um, and these are even pulled down a little bit. If I actually wanted to have them where they're at, like up on my waist, where I feel comfortable, they feel like I could potentially wash these once and they might shrink even just a little bit where they wouldn't be wearable. And so if you're looking for a pant that, that sits high on your boot, this is probably good. Um, if not, then you need to figure out the sizing. I, you know, I'm 5'11", so I'm like pretty average size and they're still short. So the only option is to either order a tall, which I think is like 33 or 34 in length, uh, or I can er order a 34 waist and a 32 length, so then the waist is gonna be too big. So this is my dilemma. I don't love how the sizing is. So I think these are technically uh, 32 waist, and they say the, the regulars are about 31 in length, which is why it makes sense that these are short. So that is my only complaint. Other than that, they fit really good. Um, I prefer a pant that's not too baggy. Uh, I prefer a little bit slimmer fitting pant and these are, are pretty darn close to that. Um, and so other than the sizing issue, I would be keeping these, but I'm not going to because again, I'm scared if I wash them once that they're going to be shrunk and then I'm going to be obviously out uh, money for these. So that is my review and my, my overview of the things I don't like. Um, the material is thick but stretchy, and so I don't see uh, an issue with these not holding up. I think they would hold up well, um, but again, sizing issue is the main problem. I hope you guys like this review. If you guys want to purchase these pants, you can go to the link in my bio and go get them right now. Hope you guys enjoy your day. Go hunt and get outside. Do what makes you happy because life's too short. We'll see you guys in the next review.